Mandalika International Street Circuit, known as Pertamina Mandalika International Street Circuit for commercial purposes, is located in the Mandalika Resort area on Lombok Island, part of the West Nusa Tenggara province of Indonesia. The circuit opened by hosting rounds of the Asia Talent Cup and Superbike World Championship in late 2021, followed by Grand Prix motorcycle races in 2022, and it is expected to host one round of the GT World Challenge Asia in October 2022. As part of the conservation maintenance, the vegetation that provides the backdrop to the Mandalika Resort area will be set aside as a conservation area of over 3,000 hectares. This area with many native species will only be accessible for low-impact activities, such as cycling or hiking to minimize damage to the flora and fauna. On the 12th of November 2021, the President of Indonesia, Joko Widodo, inaugurated the Mandalika International Circuit. He then did a lap around the racetrack. Previously, Indonesia had held World Championship Racing in 1996 and 1997 as well as the Superbike from 1994 to 1997, all at the Sentul International Circuit in Bobo, West Java near the nation's capital of Jakarta. However, due to the financial crisis, Indonesia was forced to suspend its motorsport hosting program. This circuit was built to increase the number of tourists who come to the Mandalika Resort area and introduce new tourist destinations. was a 146.94.
is a 149.21. The project was heavily criticized by the United Nations, due to reports of local Sasak people being dispossessed of their homes, lands and livelihoods. The Indonesian government, through its permanent mission of the Republic of Indonesia to the United Nations, World Trade Organization and other international organizations Geneva, Switzerland, rejected the allegations as false and hyperbolic narrative. The permanent mission also issued the report chronicling the Mandalika construction and explanations and clarifications surrounding it. The main circuit, normally raced in 4.313 kilometers, 2.68 miles long. Repsol Honda racer, Mark Marquez, said that the Mandalika circuit has a simple layout. This is a simple circuit in terms of layout, but the conditions make it interesting. There is only one line to overtake. Despite the difficult track conditions, the layout was met with praise from riders, with Honda's Pola Spargaro noting that it has its own character, the track is nice. It has a little bit of everything, said Aspargaro. Yeah. Uh -huh.